What's up everybody, it's EJ Webbs here back with another video and I know the dying question that everyone has on their mind. What is your full Pokemon binder collection look like? Well, how many Ultra Rares do you have? What's your Master Sets look like? Because I know you're all are asking that, so what I'm going to be doing in this video is I'm going to show you guys all my binders, all my Master Sets from Sun and Moon all the way up to Sword and Shield with a few late XY in there to see all my Ultra Rares, all the Reverse Hollows, everything I have for my master set. So let's get into it with my first binder. Here is my first binder. This is the binder I started off with. This one has the first five Sun and Moon series sets. We have, starting off, we have Sun and Moon base. So I do have a lot of cards from this. This is one of my most open Sun and Moon sets. As you can see here, we have all the reverse hollows. Up there is Decidueye GX. And I'm missing some cards right there. That's uh, Lorantis GX. There's, there's this Incineroar GX. And then we have all these Reverse Hollows. I'm missing Primarina GX. And then we have more Reverses. There's Espeon GX. And then we get into the Fighting types. There's Umbreon. And then Solgaleo. And there. There we have Poros, going on to the trainers, and then we get into the full arts. I only have like one a full art from the set. I don't know. There's Umbreon GX right there. I pulled that. And then we have two secret rares. We have the Solgaleo GX, and then we have the Psychic Type Energy Secret Rare. Now we're going into Guardians Rising, and I am missing a lot of reverse hollows. So there we have the obligatory Galissapod hollow, which I pull all the time and I complain about when I pull. Good old Oracoria, they're missing a bunch of GXs here. We have Salazzle, Turtonator, and the Chandelure Hollows right there. And we have the Water Types, more, I guess. And then here are the Psychic Types. There is Tapu Lele GX, pulled a few copies of that card. Worth pretty much nothing now. And then we have Lycanroc, a shot of that Lycanroc GX. Metagross GX. Kamoo GX got that in a trade. This is where we get into the full arts. I have the Vicavolt GX. Then I also have Sylveon GX full art. And then I also have Drop of Full Art. Then I do have this Enhanced Hammer Secret Rare and Wishy Washy Rainbow Rare. So now we're going on to Burning Shadows. This is my next set that I have. There we have the Glissapie GX, Charizard. And then we have the electric types, I'm gonna go through this kind of fast because nothing really too crazy on the pages where there aren't ultra rares. I do still need a lot of ultra rares from Burning Shadows. Up there is Gardevoir GX. And then we've got, moving on to the full arts, we have the Tapu Fini full art that I pulled out of the Elite Trader box. And then the uh, Lycanroc full art, and then we have Plumeria full art, and then we have Necrozma GX. So, if you ever remember, remember me pulling these cards on my channel, that's pretty cool. You remember all these memories of pulling these cards back, well, all the way back when these sets were new and I was opening them pretty frequently. So we have Crimson Invasion right now, that's that page. Start off with a Gyarados GX, which I pulled fairly recently, like eight months ago. And then we have more. I haven't opened up too much Crimson Invasion. I'm missing a lot of cards from the set because I just don't open it. It's like hard to find. And then we have more cards. There's a GX up there. Alone, Executor. Then we have Sil Valley. And then we do have a couple full arts. We have uh, Alolan Golem. And then we have Buzzwool. Here is Shining Legends, the other set. I do have all the hollows. And a couple of reverses. And then we have Entei there. And Mewtwo, the Mewtwo I'm always pulling. There's Raichu. I'm gonna get that in a train very soon, so that's about what we filled. Because I don't think I'm gonna open up that much more Shining Legends of the Zorak, which I keep on pulling. And then we have Pokemon Breeder Full Art, Entei Rainbow Rare, and then we have Mewtwo, Mewtwo, which I pulled two of. And also, have a few of the reverse hollow energies. So that's it for that first binder. Let's move on to binder number two. 
All right, this is binder number two. This has all the sets from 2018. Ultra Prism, Forbidden Light, Celestial Storm, Lost Thunder, and Dragon Majesty. And I'm warning you guys about this binder. The pages, almost all the pages came out, so I have to be very careful. And here we go, here's Ultra Prism. Probably not gonna open up that much Ultra Prism in my future, because it's so hard to find. You do not wanna buy it online. So, lots of Ultra Prism. Do have a lot of good cards, like that Dusk Main, Necro Dawn Wings Necrozma, and then we have Dark Ride Prism Star. I haven't pulled a Prism Star in a long time. And there's these um, Dusk Main, that's the right one. And then we have the Dialga in the corner right there. I think this part of the binder is mainly all right. A lot of the pages are in there. Cyrus Prism Star, and then here we go. We have the uh, Super Boost Energy Prism, and then we have the Celestila GX. We have the Palkia GX, and then we have Cynthia Farth which was previously my most uh, valuable card I ever pulled until about a month ago when you know what happened. And then we do have this Volkner Flirt, which I pulled from a Dollar Tree pack. And then an interesting car about this is Skateboard. This was never pulled on my channel. Uh, a guy I went to uh, college with, but I still do, he uh, gave me all his Pokemon cards because he bought some packs. He's like, nah, I'm not into Pokemon cards. So he gave them all to me. And then I was going through all my cards about a week ago. And I realized this was in a deck box. So I had no idea this was skateboard was there. So I'm super pumped about that. Then we have Peking Red card also. That's the secret rare. Now with Forbidden Light, one of my favorite sets. Because it features Kalos, which is one of my favorite uh, regions in the Pokemon game. And then... A lot of Gen 6 Pokemon, and then we have a Palkia GX right there. Volcanion Prism Star. The only Prism Star I'm missing from the set is Diancie Iganadel, which I pulled fairly recently too. And then Zygarde. And then we got Arceus Prism Star. And then we have Lysander Prism Star. Here's the, the pages are coming out. Here is the Evil Tall art which I pulled from my um, pre-release kit from that and also with the Crash Ray full art that's why I opened my first packs and then in the same pre-release kit I pulled the rainbow rare version of Evil Tall. Celestial Storm here is the next set we're gonna go through and now all these pages are out so careful a little bit here there's Blaziken GX which I never pulled on the channel that was from that guy I was talking about too all right and there's Mr. Mime GX, not really too valuable of a GX card there. And then one of my favorite um, hollows from the set is Lunala, which is right there. I really love that card. Talosan GX, which I pulled a few copies of. Jirachi Prism Star, there's a Sogaleo hollow I like as well. Latios Prism, Latios Prism Star, and then we have Stack Attack, which was also pulled off, off the channel. Rayquaza GX, not sure if I have too many I do have a good amount of secret rares from the set, as you can see right there. I do have the uh, Apricorn Maker Full Art, and then we have the Stack Attack of Full Art, and then the uh, more cards. We have the Electrode Rainbow Rare right there. Then we have the Hustle Belt, and then we have the Pokenav Secret Rare, one of my favorite secret rares, because you can see the map of Hoenn on the thing. Here is Dragon Majesty, one of uh, another special set, just like Shining Legends and Hidden Fates. Of course, I have not pulled the Gold Ultra to Cosma yet, so it's a little... I want to open more packs, but they're so hard to find. There's Victini Prism Star, Kingdra GX, Reshiram GX. And then we have Salamence. And then we have White Kyurem, Lance Prism Star. And then we have Kingdra Full Art right there. We have Altaria Full Art. Then we have Altaria Rainbow Rare. Uh, then we have White Kiram Rainbow Rare. And that's it for Dragon Majesty, a little shorter set there. Now we have Lost Thunder, missing a lot of cards from Lost Thunder, even though there's so, so many packs. Shuckle GX right there. We have Sceptile GX, Verizian GX right there out of the Elite Trainer box I opened of that set. We have Lacephalon GX, Zeraora GX, which is very valuable at one point. Then we have Sigilith, featuring Wobbuffet right there, one of the best cards from the set. And then we have more cards. There's a Lola Ninetales GX, one of the most valuable cards in the set, but Rainbow Rare. Then we have Xerneas, and then we have Mimikyu GX right there. Lugia Prism Star, not Lugia Prism Star, Lugia GX. 
Then we have the Prism Stars, we have Heat Factory, then we have Life Forest, and then we have Lusamine. And then get on to the full arts in the set. I have Shuckle, and we have Sceptile, Suicune, Zara Aura, and Lugia. And do we have any secret rares? No. Oh, yeah, we do. We have Zara Aura right there. That's it with binder number two. Let's move on to binder number three, boys. Yeah. All right, so I'm going, here is the third binder. This is the thickest. It's got so many pages, holds so many sets. Here, let's go into this. Here we have Team Up. This is a big daddy binder. Why did I say that? That's weird. Here's Team Up. There. A lot of Team Up. Team Up is also one of my favorite sets. There's Ampharos GX. Uh, we have uh, Mr. Mime GX, another Mr. Mime. Lycanroc in the corner there. We have Koopa, Kobolion, and then this is the last fe feature of Prism Stars. So we have Black Market, Prism Star, and here we have, there's Wondrous Labyrinth, and then we have the Magikarp and Wailer and Alt Art, the Gengar and Mimikyu, Full Art, the Alternate Art of that same card. There's Kobolion Full Art. And then we have some Twilight Trainers here. We have er Dana and Erica's Hospitality. And then some Secret Rares. We have Metal Goggles and Dr a Dangerous Drill. Here's in Broken Bonds. I've opened up a fair amount of the set. Haven't opened up it in a while. Fairmost and Buzzwole in the corner. We have Venomoth, which I pulled pretty, pretty recently. Then we have Blastoise GX. We have a Muck and a Lowen Muck, please. Pause the video if you want to see the pages in more depth. And then we have the Marshall and Machado and Machamp. And then we have a lot of empty pages. I don't know why I have so many empty pages. There's Honchkrow in the corner. Lucario and Melmetal. And then we have nothing really too much on this page. The trainers. And then we have the Florets. We have Baramosa and Buzzwole Alt Art. We have Benamoth GX Full Art. We have the Muck and Alone Muck Full Art. And then the Alolan Muck and Muck Alternate Art. And then we have some secret rares. We have Venomoth GX. And there's Janine Full Art, which isn't a secret rare. And now this is where I have some Sun um, XY sets. This is Steam Siege. Oh boy, Steam Siege. I'll go through this fast. You probably just don't care. There's Oak Canyon. Clawitzer Break. And then we have just more stuff, Steelix, and then Mega Steelix, Evaltal Break, and another Hydreigon Break, and then here's the Steelix EX Full Art, and then the Mega Steelix, and then that's actually the next page, Mega Gardevoir Full Art, Professor Sycamore Full Art, Volcanium Secret Rare. Now we have the Evolutions, I went up so much Evolutions. We have Venusaur, Mega Venusaur, uh, Charizard, Mega Charizard, Charizard Hollow, Ninetales, Blastoise, Mega Blastoise, Slowbro, yay, Mega Slowbro, I always dread pulling those, we have um, Staryu, Break, Mewtwo, Nidoking Break, I pull a lot of copies of that card, and then we, there is Pidgeot EX, and then we have the Holographic Energies, and then we have the floor on the other side. So here is the Mega Charizard Y, Mega Blastoise, and then we have Mewtwo, Mega Pidgeot, Dragonite, Brock's Grits, and then I also have the Secret Rares in this set right there. And now two fates collide. This set is a very easy set to complete because most of the cards are under $5 as of right now. So if you wanna complete the set, you'll probably do it under $50, let's say. There's all the water types. As you can see, there's a lot of cards I'm missing. Regirock EX, the first EX I ever pulled. And then we have Carbink Break, one of the first breaks I pulled. Then Bronzong, Mega Altaria, Kingdra, that came in a box. Autono, Altaria. And then we have some trainers. And then we have a few flowers. We have the Omega Alkazam, Umbreon. And then Alakazam, Secret Rare. Here's Breakthrough. I think this is the last XY set. And I'm just gonna go through this kind of quickly. You have Mega Glalie and regular Glalie. Then we have Raichu Break, Mega Mewtwo, the other Mewtwo. 
And I'm just gonna keep on going here. There is Zoroark break. Floor just break. Noivern break. Break, break, break. Give me a Kit Kat, cause I need a break. And then we have some full arts. We have Glalie EX full art. We have Mega Glalie, we have Mewtwo. We have Mega Mewtwo, other Mega Mewtwo. And then here is Unified Minds. This is the XY set I've opened most of, and I'm still missing so many cards. We have Rowlet and Alola Executor. And then we, there is some Hollows, uh, Slowpoke and Slowpoke and Psyduck, my Bane of My Existence. I like the card, however, I pull it so often. Raichu and Alolan Raichu, the only one I'm missing of that is a Rainbow Rare. Mewtwo and Mew, Espeon, Deoxys, Jirachi. The, that card I pulled so many of them, so you're tired of, tired of pulling that. All right, skipping over here, we have Umbreon and Dark Ride, Mega Sableye and Tyranitar, Weavile, and then I'm gonna get a Dragon and EX, a GX very soon, and I think that's pretty much it for that right now. And then we do have a lot of trainers. And then we do have the full arts. We have Mega Slowpoke and Psyduck Alt Art, Keldeo Full Art, Raichu and Lolan Raichu, Raichu and Lolan Raichu Alt Art, and then Blues Tactics. And then we also have Heatran, Rainbow Rare, and then Giant Bomb, Secret Rare. So that, and then, oh yeah, Birdie and Forest, Secret Rare. That's all, I also have that. So here we go on to Hidden Faiths, everyone's favorite set. One of my favorite uh, Sun and Moon series sets. I have every card from the main set except for Raichu GX and Geobinus XL. So Pinsir, Charizard, Gyarados, Mewtwo, Onix, the Birds, Wigglytuff, and all these rares. And then we have the Full Art Birds, Rainbow Birds, and Jesse and James Full Art. Now here is the shinies. I'm gonna do a trade with somebody to get the Curlia and Ralts shiny. So those will be added to my collection very soon. We have the Scyther shiny, Rowlet shiny, Charmander, Alolan Vulpix. There's Quagsire, Froki, Rogadier, Voltorb, Shuppet, Inke, Malamar. Then we have Rockruff, Guzzlord, Magnemite, Feldum, Matang, Kartana, Diancie, Altaria, Eevee, Swablu, Noibat, Orangaroo, Type Null, and here are the Full Art Shinies. I do need a lot of them. We have Leafeon, Ho-Oh, Zerkatry, and then there's Lucario, the newest one in my collection. There is Lycanroc, Buzzwool, Guzzlord, Kartana, and of course, you cannot forget the shiny Charizard, which you do not have in the binder. I don't want to get damaged at all. I have it in a sleeve and top loader. And then I also have the Shrine of Punishment, which is the only card from the Shiny Vault set that is not a shiny. There's the Zoroark and Megros. I just put those there because I didn't really know where to put them. And then also have the Reverse Energies right there. Here is Cosmic Eclipse. I have not opened too much Cosmic Eclipse. I definitely need to open up the Elite Trainer Box. I'm not getting a booster box of this set. Uh, so definitely will be opening some more in the future, but I don't know how much. So I'm missing a lot of cards. Um, mainly hollows and some commons and uncommons. There's Blastoise and Piplup, GX. Don't have too many GXs from this set. I have these are a lot of holes I'm missing. A lot of regular rares I'm missing too. There's Oracorio. And then there he is missing a lot of stuff. You even need a lot of hollows too. There's Sol Galeo. Gorgeous. Oh, so gorgeous. There's some, uh, we got uh, Dialga, Palkia, and Arceus. And then we have <coughs> Neganadel and Guzzlord. And then I have just trainers. And then a few full arts. We have Oracorio full art. And then we have Guzman Hala full art. And then we have Professor Oak setup full art. Do not have any secret rares in this set, which is surprising. But, well, besides the character cards, here is Flannery, the uh, Torkoal, Pikachu, and then we have Mimikyu, Excadrill, and Steelix. We'll have one more, uh, two more binders to show you, but those will be very quick. Remember when I said I had two binders left? Well, I lied, because I have three. <laughs> Well, these will be very quick. This is my sword and shield binder. And since the set just released, 
I don't have many cards, and plus this is only set to focus in this binder. So we have Celebi V, which I pulled in a recent video. Victini V, as you can see, there's so many holes because I opened up 14 packs of this set. And then we there is Dreadnought. I don't know why I said Dreadnought. There's Tapu Coco V. And then there is uh, Galarian Obstagoon, which I bought uh, some packs and I opened them off screen and I ended up pulling Galarian Obstagoon. There's Zacian V. And then that's pretty much it for this one. And then we have the Stone Journey V. That's it for a Sword and Shield, not too much to talk over. I'll definitely go over the, the binder for Sword and Shield when I buy, buy more packs and open more packs. And there's my cat right over there. And yeah, let's get into the promo binder. And here is the promo binder featuring all my promo from Sun, promos from Sun and Moon and XY and then also uh, some Sword and Shield. So there's Snorlax GX, Lunala GX, Solgaleo GX, Lycanroc GX. We do have all these promos laid out. As this is still zoomed in, we have the Tapu Bulu, Tapu Coco, Beware, Espeon. I'm not gonna say all these names because there's so many ultra rares. We have Shiny Co Tapu Coco, Charizard Full Art, which is always nice. We also have a bunch of Ultra Beast cards, some Shiny Pokemon from that big box, Hello Rainbow Rare, Raichu, J Zorark, Full Arts, and then we have from those from the box, and more Ultra Rares. Ultra Rares, the Ultra Rares on Ultra Rares. We have the Shikiram, now almost said Shiny, and then, all right, some Alt Arts from the box, those tins. Melt Metal GX. All right, some Detective Pikachu cards, the Charizard card, and then some, yeah, these Detective Pikachu cards, a stamp logo on them, and then some Hidden Fates cards. And then after Hidden Fates, we have some Cosmic Eclipse with the Armor and Mewtwo. And then here we go with XY. And since I didn't collect earlier XY, I don't have that many of the promos. Most of XY I did not collect. And all the um, sets that I open up, small amounts like Primal Clash and Ancient Origins, I do not have these as a master set. They're just loose in one of my Elite Trainer boxes. Cause that's not worth taking up binder space for a set that's so empty. There's some breaks, some ultra rares. There's not too much to go over here. And then here we go with the Sword and Shield promos. Not too many, we just have Kru Kruki, Score Bunny, Sable, Meowth, and Meowth and Emax. We also have the ones from the, the Sword and Shield Blisters. We have Gossip Flutter, Wooloo, More Peko, and Alolan Ponyta. And the very last binder I'm gonna show you is my Detective Pikachu set. This is the only set I have uh, fully completed, even though there's only like 18 cards in the set. There's just, yeah, that's it. I mean, that, that's it. And then I also have the Detective Pikachu, which I got from the movie. And that's it. So that's gonna do it for this video. If you like seeing my Pokemon card collection, make sure to like, subscribe, and join the EJ Webs Nation. I'm trying to get to 200 subscribers by the end of February. So if you're not a member, subscribe and leave a comment below, and maybe I'll update my collection in the future. So see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.